scientists. Today we are learning about something new called natural resources. Natural means things that we can find in the world that people did not make. And resources are things that we can use. So natural resources are things that we use for lots of things that we can make or do that come from the natural world. A person did not make them. So let's start with our first natural resource today. Rocks! I bet that you have seen lots of different rocks all over the place, especially if you like to explore outside. Someone gave me this rock from the beach. It's nice and smooth, doesn't have any sharp parts on it. It's kind of gray with some white dots on it, so it's an interesting color. And it's pretty big. It's not huge, but it's not tiny either. Rocks can look and feel different ways. Here's another rock I have, and I want you to tell me if you think they look or feel the same. Here's my other rock. Do you see how some parts are the same or different? They're a very similar size. One is not that much bigger than the other, but their color is different. Their shape is different. This one is more like a circle, and this one has lots of different edges. This one is nice and smooth to touch, but this one is a little bit sharp and rough. So you can see rocks can look lots of different ways. And do you know that we use rocks for all kinds of things? This one just sits on my desk Sometimes I hold papers under it so the papers don't fly away. Sometimes it's just to look at. Let's take a look at some other rocks. You might be surprised that some of these things are rocks. Let's see if you knew about all of these kinds of rocks. First, I have a pencil. Did you know that a pencil is made of rock? This is a special kind of rock called graphite. Graphite is a rock that we can use to write on things. I bet you are very familiar with this kind of rock. And there's some other rocks too. You might have heard of chalk. Chalk is a rock that we use to write on things as well. Let's take a look at another kind of rock. This is a very small rock. You can see it falling inside there. They are very small pieces. This is a rock called sand. I know some of you like to play with sand a lot. Did you know that sand is lots of little rocks all together? Let me show you some other rocks, but these ones are not so small. Here you can see a really big rock in a place in Turkey called Cappadocia. Can you spot Miss Huddleston next to the rock? Now you can see how big this rock must be. I hope you enjoyed learning about rocks today. I'm excited to see the rocks that you find and hear what they feel like and what they look like, their shape, their color, their size. See you later, scientists. We can make lots of things out of rock. Do you know our school is made out of a kind of rock called cement? Did you know our school is made out of rock? A kind of rock called cement. Lots of buildings are made out of this kind of rock. My apartment building is too. I wonder what kinds of things around you you can find that are made of rock. 